as you get down to this last region here, the last, uh, approximately last one octave, you can notice right away that there's very little lost motion in these notes. And you might say, well, you know, how could there be so much less lost motion in these notes, which are probably used almost as much as the notes in the sub bass register, and yet, as you can tell by the number of turns here, I'm only having to turn these one, two, maybe three turns, whereas the notes down in the sub bass region had to be turned eight and ten turns to remove all of the lost motion. And I must say that it uh, kind of surprised me too that there was so much of a difference. Now this particular one is calling me a liar, but We'll get to these last four here and you'll see that that's all the lost motion that there is so it made me think you know, how could there be so much less lost motion in these notes than there are in the one in the sub bass register and then the uh, the, the answer came to me almost as quickly as I asked the question and what it has to do with is the amount of weight that is being moved down on the bass register of the piano you've got these hugely heavy hammers <coughs> and I'll show you right now You've got these hugely heavy hammers. Are you talking to me, Tom? No. Oh. You got these hugely heavy hammers down in the bass region of the piano, as opposed to these extremely small and light ones up here in the front, up in the top. And so as a consequence, the amount of energy that's required to move these hammers down here is far le as far greater than the amount of energy required to move these. Therefore, with the same amount of energy applied, these ones down in this region are going to wear out faster than the ones in the region which is used about the same amount. And as you saw with the center region of the piano, that's where the most wear occurred, but the hammers in that region of the piano are relatively mid-sized all the way through. So, the point being is that the heavy hammers cause more wear even though they don't get used as much than the light hammers in the treble section whereas the uh, hammers and the adjustments in the center were obviously needed more adjustment because of sheer wear.